Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in. We're going to crack open a YZZN1 Toyota Genuine Oil Filter. I got this from my dealer. Um, and this fits the 21 Sienna. Uh, the same counterpart for the Fram is the XG4967. Um, so first off, you know, we'll just see that the Toyota oil filter on the face of it, it, it's more flat and the ports going in are rectangular, whereas the Fram are circular ports and it's slightly uh, slanted. <clears throat> Other than that, you'll see that the uh, there's actually five uh, rings uh, for you to screw on for the RAM, whereas FRAM rather, um, whereas the Toyota only has uh, three three rotations on that. So I don't think those are huge differences. Um, and the other thing is I like the inside of the the Toyota. There was uh, just a bit more circular ports for the oil to flow out, whereas the FRAM seemed to have a bit less. But let's crack them open. Let's see what's inside. Basically, what kicked this whole um, interest off was Amsoil claimed that Toyota oil filters were only 50% efficient at 20 microns, whereas their Amsoil ones were about 90, not north of more than 90% efficient at 20 microns. And Fram actually claims 99% um, efficient at um, 20 microns. So I, j I just wanted to kind of dig into this myself. There was a few videos of them cracking this open, but I just wanted to dig into it myself and look at the paper uh, material because... A lot of them actually said that, um, actually here, here we're just cracking this open. There's, um, that's the uh, anti-drain back valve. Not sure if that's silicone or rubber. And there's the, the cone you, there you'll see. And then the paper material. And you see how the resin only goes about halfway through uh, the top and the bottom. That's basically what people are saying is the reason for why Toyota's are only 50% efficient at the 20 microns is because the oil actually go through the, um, the uh, outer folds where where the paper folds on the outer edge because it's not red there's no resin there or they can't see the resin there that that's why um you know that's an opportunity for the oil to go through and hence only 50 percent efficient now i'm not disputing the data but what, what what i basically did here is i cut it open and i'm trying to rip the paper apart um in a clean way to show that actually the the Toyota filter actually they do glue the outer folds as well as the inner folds, so that's not the reason for the fifty percent of you know only fifty percent efficient. You know here I'm really trying to separate them out. I'm not able to. They're actually glued together. Um, having said that though, the the data I do you know it, it does show that it is only fifty percent, whereas everybody else is ninety percent. Or, or north of 90 percent and i think um maybe toyota is trying to balance the 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 strain on the oil pump versus um how clean uh the oil is and, and you know that's just my guess I'm, I'm not totally sure having said that i am going to switch to fram um from now on i do you know do feel like i do want a cleaner oil um and, and that's basically it that's uh that's that's all um, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys have any questions, comments, please uh, leave a comment below. I'll be uh, happy to talk about this a bit more. Thanks.